Hello, strange people. Hello. Uh, it's been a while. It's been uh, at least like a, a year. And the reason for that, Jay and I have been going through a rough patch and decided to break up and not do this. <laughs> for two days. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys, you have a strange face. <laughs> I'm taking a 10 hour flight just to get away from, from this woman. Mm. Yeah, we'll tell you more later. <sighs> ah, my kids! So I dropped off the kids to school. Mosquito, mosquito bit me. So it's the last time that I'm gonna see my my son, Kamiel. I'll miss you, boy. I'll miss you. Unfortunately, he, he can't go with us because he has school. And um, yeah, it's nothing else to say about that. But I'm really gonna miss him. Yeah, I kind of feel a little bit sad because it's not a vacation. Um, we're going for my other son, Jamie. And yeah, I just can't bring Kamel along with me, with us. And But hey, that's life. See you soon, Kamel. Mmm, that beeping is annoying. Okay, I got out of work because I have too many free hours in between. So I'm gonna drop off Daniel at the airport. And then I'm alone. I'll be a single mom for three days. And he has arrived. Hello. Hello. Pass me the keys. The dogs are outside. Gracias. No crying. No crying. <laughs> Our last few seconds together. I don't know what to say. I'm leaving. Leave me alone. I already told them I'm gonna be a single mom. I'm a single dad. Oh God, you don't have the kids. You can't call yourself a single dad. You don't have the kids. I'm a single. You're single. I'm single. <laughs> hey, you know what I just realized? What? <gasps> I ain't got my wedding ring on. Why not? <laughs> Summer in my backpack. <laughs> Why? Mm. Checked in. There's no turning back now. Mm. Not bad. I wanted to take a selfie of me drinking coffee, and then I spilled it all over myself. Ten hours. It's a long flight, so neck pillow. I have finished working, and I'm just dropped the kids off at home, and now I am driving to the hospital to pick up medicine. So I don't know if I've ever told you guys about Jamie. So Jamie is a hemophilia. So if you want more information about hemophilia, just let us know in the comments down below. But um, what that means for me when it comes to traveling or us when it comes to traveling is that I always have to travel with extra medicine just in case something happens either on the flight or on the trip if something happens then I have enough medicine to treat him so we're going to Holland for a medical reason it's gonna be a small operation to be honest any operation is not really a small operation when it comes to kids um, but we've experienced this like three times already and um, every single time it went well I'm being very dangerous right now, so I'm gonna stop here and then I'll see you guys in a bit. I arrived at the Panama airport. Good flight, easy flight, two hours flight. Couldn't sleep, watch Netflix, watch the fire documentary. I'm gonna look for some coffee, maybe get some something to eat, and then enjoy my four hour layover in Panama City. on uh, FaceTime. Yeah, I really miss her. I miss her. It's like maybe half hour before departure time and after killing four hours in Panama with this mask on, it's horrible. I am now um, waiting to leave Panama. 
and Boy 10 plus our flight to Amsterdam. So it's night time and I'm alone. I'm not used to being alone at night and not even having anybody to talk to. So that's how I attach, how attached I am to my husband and how attached he is to me. Maybe. It sounds bad, honestly. Anyway, I'm gonna hop in the shower and then I'll probably go sleep. Finally got here. I'm gonna meet my aunt for some coffee and then I'm gonna go to her house and stay there for a couple of days. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Hello, strange people. I'm gonna meet up my brother at three o'clock at the central station. For some reason, I can't, I can't find Wi Fi over here. It's freaking cold. Well, it changed a lot here though. There's a Starbucks, there's like a bunch of stuff here, shops here, stuff. I can't talk, I'm, my mouth is frozen. Hey, it's day one or the first full day being alone. And I am gonna go shopping for the last stuff that I need before I go to Holland. Okay, just bought myself some jeans because I don't have any. So now I'm ready to fly. So I'm giving you guys a different angle because this is like the safest angle I can get right now. I did some shopping. I bought two jeans ready to go because I didn't have any jeans um, and it's really cold in Holland so I really needed them. And then my watch broke. The area where it holds it, that part's broken. I have a reason to write a review now. I'm gonna go home, see what the kids wanna eat, and I'll see y'all later. So I just had a video call with Dan, and I've recorded it twice already, our video calls, and every single time it doesn't capture the sound, whether the mic is on or off. Um, so that kind of sucks. I'm gonna get ready for a wedding. I have an hour to get ready, about an hour to get ready. So let's see how this goes. Okay, I'm just ready. I've been having trouble with the eyelashes, but they're on. I'll let you have a look at my outfit. You guys have seen this on Instagram. It's 11 p.m. and I'm back home. Um, this is the loneliest I've ever been. You know, like Dan's not here, the kids aren't here, now the dog's not even here, the dog went outside. I'm gonna put the clothes in the dryer, wash my face. I guess I'm gonna call it a night. Okay, I'll see you. Hello, strange people, and good morning. I just woke up. First date in Amsterdam. Last night was legit. I can't tell you why, but it was legit. I severely underestimated how cold it was gonna be, and despite being warned by my aunt and everyone else around me, I decided to be a macho man and just wear a very thin shirt. Actually, I'm not tired, I'm just groggy. From the sleeping pills I took last night to fall asleep alone. I think I walked almost like nine kilometers through the city and I burned roughly a thousand calories. First night without Kaylee was good. I had the whole bed to myself. So something very strange though, I think uh, because of the jet lag, I woke up 1 a.m. and dude, I was hungry. So I started to eat my, my croissants that I bought at Albert Heijn and I just ransacked it. I even like ate all the crumbs. Today, Kaylee is leaving to come to Holland to reunite with me. That makes me really happy. That makes me really happy. So I wonder what she's doing right now. <laughs> Today I'm eating vegetarian food. No, vegan food, right? Vegan food. It's vegan food, yeah. Yes. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, it's only two more, yeah?
This is actually really, really good. I've had the Impossible Whopper beef before yeah. from Burger King. This tastes so much better. Good morning. So I just got off a call with Dan. I have to get up. I have to start doing something. I'm leaving in about 12 hours and the house is still a mess. I'll go get ready. Kids are being annoying. Um, mommy made me breakfast, so I'm eating pancakes. Can you lower it? Are you ready to go to Yoda? Getting my sweat on. Get my ass to working at the gym. Even if it's freaking winter, it's minus one. Degrees. Brothers. Are you okay, Mial? So we have encountered a problem. Yep. Uh, um, a big problem. Even though I'm married to Dan and everything, they still need a letter from Dan that he gives permission for us to fly. Just the two of us. So I'm waiting for my mom to print it out and bring it for me. And then hopefully I'll get through. Okay, so we managed to get in. I had to wait an hour to get my stuff. Thanks, mom, for doing that. <laughs> excited? Yeah, so excited. Excited for medical reasons. <sighs> anyway. You like it? Yeah. <laughs> tell, us, tell them where we are. We're on the plane right now. Yeah. Anyway, now we're going to sleep. Ready to sleep? Yeah. <laughs> my blanket and my food and my shirt. Where's Shelly? Right here. Oh, okay. I need to wear my seatbelt. Yeah. We have arrived. <laughs> and Jamie had a really good sleep. Yeah. Oh, you, you, you. So we're gonna get our bags now. Hello, strange people, and good morning. Today is D Day. Day Kaylee and Jamie are joining me on this tremendous adventure that we call I don't know what we call it but we call it something yeah I'm ready to pick up Kaylee and Jamie from the airport I took a tram and a train to get here it was pretty easy just had to go online and buy the ticket and yeah here we are uh, waiting for Kaylee to, to arrive and then yeah, I'll see how it goes bye hi hello <laughs> Jay yeah why are you walking towards the camera don't stay, stay, stay still stay still bye. How was the flight? Fun. Did you sleep? Yep, a lot. Yeah? Did you sleep a lot? He slept a lot. He slept a lot. He oh. didn't even want to wake up oh. for breakfast. Oh. Hold on. Hello. I'm so happy. And it feels so good. <laughs> We're going to my sister. Sister. Jamie, is it cold? Yeah, it's super cold. Super cold. Okay. Look at my jungle boy. Jungle boy. I've missed you guys so much. Bear. I've missed you guys a lot. Mall, y'all. Yeah, yeah. Just walking and being silly. Because it's like we haven't seen each other in a week. Years. Can like, you honestly, see on my face like... how cold it is? Yeah. I'm not saying I'm shivering cold. It's just that my face is frozen cold. I'll stop being a wussy. I look yellow. <laughs> yellow. We're yellow people. <laughs> Oh, where, where are we? Upstairs. We're in that house. I seriously lost them. What? I seriously lost them. <laughs> You're lost? There you guys are. Yeah, I lost you guys. Hmm. 
It was a nice visit. We visited my dad, had a nice little chat about family tree and whatnot. So that was nice. And now we're off to home because it's eight yeah. something. And Aliyah has to go to sleep because she has school and she's taking us home. So uh, I'm gonna put the camera down and follow the leader. 